this little exercise called the expiration date exercise. Because people, yes, expiration date. Here's interesting stuff here. You have got probably in your refrigerator a bottle of wine, a really great Chablis, <laughs> a, really, a really great white Zinfandel from 1997 that you are waiting to open with that dream date on that magical occasion. People, here's the interesting thing. Everything on this planet is going to expire. I'm going to expire, you're going to expire, your loved ones, your family, your friend, things that you possess, things in your immediate environment. There is an expiration date to everything. And what I find really interesting is that we keep postponing our life. We far exceed the expiration date because we keep waiting for things to show up the way we think it's going to show up. So we keep wait, holding on to that, that bottle of wine until it becomes beyond vintage, until it becomes vinegar, because you're waiting. Stop letting things, stop letting the expiration date of things in your life be used so that you have to trash them. You know what's interesting about waiting for that magical moment? The magical moment is now, because you're alive now. Stop waiting for it for two weeks from now, or two years from now, or that time. It's now. So what I did is I started looking through my refrigerator, and I was like, oh, God, okay. I have a bottle of sesame tahini here, organic sesame tahini. Expiration date, December, no, September... 2005. Why, why am I waiting to celebrate this tahini with Sharon? That moment has passed. Then I came up across mm, Island Teriyaki Soy Sauce, best used by January 19th, 2009. Yes, not going to work. Then I came across this lovely instant chocolate pudding. It was on sale for 49 cents. The expiration date was in 2003. Listen, people, what was I waiting for? Because I'm going to make a magical chocolate souffle for my boyfriend? Listen, I could have been having chocolate souffle for myself every night, indulging myself in my own chocolate souffle, instead of waiting around for this magical moment with something or someone that is, is a projected idea of the future. The expiration date has passed, people. So what you're going to do is this. You're going to go through your fridge. You're going to pull out items whose expiration date has long passed. And here's the tricky part. You're on the honor system here. For each item you pull, you are going to do something. So each item is going to represent something that you have to do that you've been postponing or procrastinating. <gasps> Yes, you have to have that little talk with your boyfriend or girlfriend. Uh, you're going to do it. Oh my God, you have to call your agent or manager because you haven't really talked to them in three months. Uh, you're going to do it. Oh my gosh, it's time for you to, I don't know. You will know. That thing that you really wanted to be writing that you keep putting off and you have all these reasons why you're really not ready to write it. Uh, you're going to do it. I don't care if you pull 15 items or three. You're going to do as many items as you pull whose expiration date has passed. Something that you are postponing or procrastinating. Good luck.